Hey, this is Bauke from LibertyToTravel.com. Welcome to my Shopspresso review. I'm here inside the dashboard of Shopspresso, this new product launching today on the 15th of May 2020 at 9 a.m. EST, a new product by Mosh Berry. And during this review, I'm going to show you inside the software, show you a demo of it, show you how it works and how you can use this product to create your very own e-commerce store that's gonna be able to sell physical products, digital products, as well as software licenses. So that is uh, in a nutshell what this product does. And during this review, we're gonna have a closer look at how that's gonna work. We're also going to have a look at the sales page right here. Have a look at the claims being made on the sales page by the creators of Shopspresso to see if, in my opinion, this product lives up to those claims. And of course, I've put together a package of custom and exclusive bonuses that you can get your hands on by purchasing Shopspresso through the link below this video. Video. Click that link, you'll come to this page on my website where you can find out more about Shopspresso, uh, the pricing, the upsells, and of course, my bonuses. Now, these bonuses are not going to be available anywhere else but through the link below this video and then by clicking any of the green buttons like this one on this page to make your purchase of Shopspresso because all of these bonuses are created by me personally from my own knowledge and experience with internet marketing specifically to help you make the most out of Shopspresso. So what are these bonuses and how are they gonna help you with this product? Now this product, as I said, is an e-commerce store builder that's going to help you sell products, digital products, um, as well as physical products, and also affiliate products if you want through your own e-commerce store. What the product is not going to help you with is driving traffic to that store. So that's where the first bonus is going to come in. I'm going to show you seven different traffic sources, my favorite traffic sources to drive traffic to your Shopspresso store. These are gonna be free and paid traffic sources that work really, really well with e-commerce. So whether you want to go with free traffic and spend your time on getting traffic or you want to just spend your money and get traffic really fast, um, that is possible with paid traffic. Both of those are covered inside the traffic courses in bonus number one. Then bonus number two, how to make your customers buy more from your Shopspresso store. In this bonus, I'm going to cover different tricks, techniques, strategies you can use to increase the conversion rate of your store. Now, this is something I learned whether it is with um, e-commerce or affiliate marketing or uh, any other type of selling online. If you implement these techniques, these conversion boosting tricks, you will see a massive increase in your revenue. It might even take you from having an unprofitable online business to a vastly profitable online business using these tricks. It's very important that you use these in any type of online business, but especially in e-commerce, because in e-commerce often the margins are a lot lower lower with, than with uh, selling digital products. Uh, so that's why this is super, super important. That's bonus number two. Bonus number three, how to use Shopspresso to build your email list and build a long-term business. Now, if you really want to make um, a lot of profits with your online business, you need to start building a list, an email list of loyal customers who keep coming back to your store for more and more products. Now, in Shopspresso, you do have the feature to gather email addresses, but other than that, not much about it is explained. So in this bonus and bonus number three, I'm gonna cover just the basics of email marketing, how to set email marketing up, what software you should be using, how to write good emails to your subscribers, but then also like more advanced stuff, like how to actually uh, make sure that your emails are going to convert your subscribers into buyers of of your products on a regular basis over and over again using really good stories in your follow-up sequences, using really good promotions in your broadcast emails, etc. All of that is gonna be covered inside this bonus, bonus number three, which is going to cover everything you need to get started with email marketing and Shopspresso. So those are my exclusive bonuses that you can get by purchasing Shopspresso through the link below this video. So after watching this review, make sure you go ahead and click that link, come to this page, click the green buttons on this page, and inside your purchase receipt on Warrior Plus, which is gonna look like this one right here, you will find my bonuses underneath the button, Access Affiliate Bonus. Now that that's over, let's go into the actual software. 
So this is the dashboard uh, and here you can just see a quick overview of your store and you can start customizing it. Now let me show you first what this store is going to look like. So this is the actual front of your store. This is what visitors to your store will see when they first go to your store to buy products from you. So here you have a big banner with different promotions that you can set up and then different categories of products that you can uh, customize. And here you can see some examples of featured products and one really cool feature of this software, for example, is when they add a product to a cart like so, immediately it's going to give a pop-up with other products. These are cross sells or upsells that are related to the product they added to their cart so that they can then purchase those as well. Now this already will see um, you get much higher uh, conversion rates on your store, much higher percentage of people buying multiple products, more than just one, if you sell them related products whenever they add a product to their cart. So that is one feature that really is great about Shopspresso. Um, yeah, and then of course, once they have uh, items in the cart, they can go to checkout and then they can go and make their purchase. Now, of course, Shopspresso, um, integrates with your own payment gateways. They actually have a lot of different payment gateways that you can integrate with, not just PayPal and Stripe, the usual, uh, but a lot of different ones as well. So if uh, you can't for whatever reason use PayPal or Stripe, then uh, you can go and add different payment gateways. I think over here you can see, uh, this is where you would actually add them. Um, somewhere over here you can see, there we go, Stripe, PayPal, Insta, Mojo, Paystack, Paytm, Molly Payment, Razor Pay, um, and more. And also, what you can do with um, any products in your store is you can recruit affiliates who can go and sell these products for you. So you can have others promote products in your store as an affiliate, get a small commission in return for doing so. And that way you can use affiliates to drive traffic to your store. This is already built into the front end of Shopspresso. So that's really cool that that is built in because normally that's like an extra software that you would have to pay for on top of your regular e-commerce platform. Whereas here that is going to be built into this software. Now um, I'll just give you a very brief demo because this is a very advanced product with a lot of different features. Uh, if you want to see a full demo from the vendor, you can see one right here on this page, accessible through the link below this video, of course. Uh, right here, you can see the demo from the vendor. Now, here is where you would add a new product. So you can add physical, digital, or licensed products. So physical, well, that speaks for itself. That's like clothes, watches, uh, anything you can think of, physical products, digital products, like video courses. And then license is like a special type of digital products, like for software, where they have to get a license for the software um, that they can then uh, use themselves. So that is uh, the difference between digital and license. Digital is more for like um, video courses, video course type products, and then license is more for software where they actually need a license to use the software because, um, for example, if you have a monthly subscription for your software, if they then cancel their subscription, you want to make sure to deactivate their license so they can't keep using the software. So that's kind of why there is a split between those two. Now, when you create a product, I'm just gonna go with physical for this example. You can set everything up about the product in here uh, in the dashboard. So you can give it a name, um, SKU, that is just a, um, like a unique identifier for the product in your store. It will be automatically generated as you can see. A category, so you can create your own categories over here uh, somewhere. There's this categories thing, uh, manage categories right there. Um, and these are the ones that are by default in your store. Uh, you can also have subcategories. So within the electronics category, you can have television, refrigerator, washing machine, air conditioners, and of course, much more because you can completely customize to yourself. And then within the subcategory, you can also have a child category. So like for televisions, for example, you can have um, like uh, televisions that are like uh, smaller than 32 inch for like the bedroom or something like that and bigger than 32 inch for the living room, something like that, just an example. Um, that is uh, that. And then warranty types, brands, uh, and you can put an image here, of course, of the product. Um, 
and also the cross-selling. So this is where um, you can select different products from your store that are gonna be upsold to people when they add this product to their cart, like I showed you earlier when we were in the store. And then the pricing, um, so this will be the current price, this will be the previous price, that's in case you have a sale going on. So you can say normally this product costs $3.99, but now it's available for $2.99. That will give you uh, the ability to show the product as being on sale right now. Um, and then um, also how much, how much stock do you have of the product? Um, and then you can give it a description, a return policy, a video URL from YouTube. If you have like a product demo video, for example, or a review, review video of your product, you can put that right here um, and then some tags and then you create the product and then it will show up in your store. So that is how you can add products to your store. Affiliate products allows you to actually sell products in your store that you are an affiliate for. So rather than um, selling your own products, you can add products from like ClickBank or Warrior Plus or JVZoo. You can add them to your store. And then when people go to check out, they will actually go to the actual Warrior Plus or JVZoo or ClickBank checkout page to buy the product. And you as the affiliate will get a commission, but you can still list these products in your store as if they are part of your um your store so that is also a possibility right here so the only difference there really is the product affiliate link option that allows you to put in the affiliate link for the product you want to sell um, then customers is where you can find your customer list vendors um, if you have like uh, other vendors that you are selling products off then you can add them here um, then um, cross-selling um, I already told you about that. That is where you have different upsells. You can also upload multiple products in bulk. If you have like an Excel spreadsheet with all of your products that you want to add, you can just upload that and it will automatically start adding these products. You can have coupons for people uh, to give them an incentive to, uh, for example, sign up to your email list. You can give them a 10% discount coupon for signing up to your email list. And then uh, they can enter that coupon for a 10% discount on their first order. And then you can start building your email list. Um, that is one example of how you could start building your email list. We have, of course, the email settings right here to start uh, building your email list. Um, so there you go. That is just a, a very brief, like I said, overview of the Shop Espresso um, dashboard and all of the different features inside that are going to help you build really cool stores just like this one right here here now the cool thing about this product is that unlike with something like shopify where you would have to pay at least 30 dollars a month just for the basic plan this is just a one-time price you pay for the product once and you can use it uh, as long as you like so you don't have to worry about having to pay a monthly fee so talking about pricing um, let's quickly go through the sales page then we'll talk about what this product is going to cost you and what the potential upsells are so are you tired of the get rich quick bs and want something that works you're one click away from activating your pandemic proof business in box in 59 seconds um, so one thing that's happening right now because everyone is sitting at home of course is that e-commerce is really really booming so i know the economy is not doing great right now but one sector that is doing really really well is e-commerce of course so that's why this product is kind of um, going to help you to try to bank on that trend of growing e-commerce people buying products from home um, and this is going to help you build your own store with your own products that you can get people to purchase and then of course make a profit from so that's the idea behind the product um, this is a very preliminary sales page there's not a lot uh, available here as you can see some of the images are not working i'm not sure why um, but you can just go ahead and check the rest of the sales page out yourself at your own pace in your own time simply click the link below this video come to this page click the green buttons go to the sales page go through it and make your decision right there now what is the price of this product going to be the price is going to be just 19 dollars at launch um, so that is front end and that is a one-time payment only as i said so there's not going to be uh, monthly recurring fees or anything along those lines then we have the different upsells so we have the unlimited upsell which is going to be 39 dollars this allows you to instead of creating just one store create unlimited stores we have a done for you upsell for 197 dollars which allows you 
to get the team behind Shopspresso to create a complete done for you setup. So they'll build your store, they fill it with products for you, uh, etc. That is the done for you upsell for $197. Done for you traffic for $57. Speaks for itself what that is. Endless profits. I'm not entirely sure what that upsell is going to be. I think it's more like an advanced course on getting more conversions and stuff like that for $67. The reseller license, which is of course this uh, license that allows you to sell Shopspresso as your own product and keep 100% of the profits for yourself is gonna be $197. And then finally, if you really want to uh, sell this product and brand it as your own product, give it a different name, give it a different look and feel, you can purchase the white label license. Now it costs $997, but if you think about it, if you're gonna hire a developer to create software like this for you, it's gonna be at least three to five times this price just to get them to create this software. So if you want to create your own Shopspresso type of business where you sell your own store software, and then you can purchase white label rights to this product for $997. Um, now, none of those upsells are necessary, of course. Everything I showed you in the demo is done just with the front end, which is gonna be $19. It's gonna come with all the bonuses that I described for you at the beginning of this video, and all of that is available through the link below this video. So go ahead, click that link, come to this page, make your decision right there. Hopefully, I'll see you on the inside, and that wraps up my Shopspresso review. So thank you so much for watching. Make sure to hit the like button if you like this review. Subscribe to my YouTube channel for more product reviews and other internet marketing tips and tricks. And hopefully I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.